Hi, this is Kevin Hua, and this is Every Dog Has Its Wedge. Today I'll show you how to fix a high-low situation on heavy plate. If you haven't seen the first part of this video about gauge plate, please check it out. So these are the tools that I'll be using today. I've got a dog, I've got a wedge, and I've got a bracing bar with a mouse hole. All these things can usually be found in your scrap bin. So what we're going to be doing is taking our dog and tacking it to our low side. We're going to take our wedge and drive it in to bring the high side down. Once we've got everything fit up, we'll put our brace on and weld it. So once again, before you get started, make sure you put on your PPE. What I've done here is put two tacks on the back side. And I'm going to drive my wedge on the same side. That way the force of the wedge does not pull off my dog. So once you've got everything leveled out and you're ready to pull your wedge out, I'm going to show you a safe way to do it because there will be residual stress underneath your wedge. So as I mentioned before, I put two tacks on the back side of this dog. Now I'm going to pry against those tacks to break this off very easily. So in heavier situations, you might not be able to leave your dog and wedge on or trust your tacks to do the job. So you're gonna need a bracing bar with a mouse hole. Once you've got your bracing bar on, you're ready to weld. What this hole is going to allow you to do is weld through the brace without having to remove it. Once you've got your weld in, you're ready to pull your brace off, and I'll show you a quick and easy way to do that. So same as before, we put our tacks on the back side of this plate. We're going to need to push this the same side of our tacks so it'll break off easy. So with using small tacks instead of full welds, you'll be able to bust that bar off easy, and clean up with the grinder is way quicker. So that's my way of showing how every dog has its wedge. I hope that this trick's helped you out a lot and made you more efficient and proficient. 